Hey guys, I was running into a situation where running through foliage here, most of the time it would make a sound, but sometimes it didn't. And I was like, what's going on here? And I realized this is a perfect use case for debug visualization. Because what I'm doing here is I'm getting the instances of the foliage that are overlapping the character's capsule. And it would be helpful to visualize that, to actually see, okay, what is the space that's being overlapped? So I can drag out a pin here and I could just search for a draw debug. And there's a whole series of draw debug tools. Like if you need to see a particular direction, you can draw an arrow, but in this case, I'm just going to use a sphere. And the center of the sphere is where we're getting the center of our instances. So I'm just going to plug that in here. I'm going to do the same thing for the radius right here. I'm going to set the debug to be five seconds here. And let's do a thickness of two. And that's just two units. That's basically two centimeters. Compile and save that. And let's give it a go. All right. So as I'm running here, yeah, we see the spheres. And we see that they're not quite large enough to always hit the foliage, right? So that's the advantage of these draw debug tools is you can see exactly what's going on visually. So I hope that's helpful, but I figured I'd mention this because I didn't know about these tools for about two years and they're really useful if you need to visualize the data. So I hope to see you next time.